Welcome back, this is Rice. Last time we got out of our Tsun Jungle, and so now we're entering in it. The Olympics have started a couple days ago, actually, when from this recording, because today is like the 30th, and we see there was a purple pipe right to start. Um, this rain effect, I don't know how that's going to affect you guys watching in YouTube land. Um, I mean, it doesn't affect me much, because I'm right here, but let's go open this purple pipe. And run up switch, and... Did I just solve that? Hold on. I just solved that. <laughs> I can't say I've had that happen often. This one I'm also running in a little bit blindly. And so, let's see if we can get it again. There we go. Crystal for us. Crystalnia. Crystalnock. Night of Crystals, Night of Broken Glass. That's a Nazi reference, which is kind of weird. I don't make those often or ever, but let's just keep on going back to where we're going. Have you ever noticed when ramming how big his arm gets relative to the rest of his body? Doesn't really make sense. Keys was right there, obviously by the box. We just need to get him later. Right? Yes, I finally looked up the name of him, and it is Keysor. I actually took the time to figure out a lot of things with this game because I I wanted to spice up my commentary a bit. It's not a something I probably should have done for a while ago about this game, but there's a ton of little things here and there. There's something like huge or something I could find out, but um, I did find out the difficulty of the passages, they're actually uh, indicated by uh, uh, they're not indicated by anything, but it just is a diff I can go down or not. Um, I'll just go this way. There is a difficultiness you can figure out. Um, and by that I mean, like, you can figure out, like, the difficulty in between, uh, the stuff, like, the green passage, and I found out, I didn't take the time to say it, but I meant to earlier, it's themed around, uh, nature, what? Okay, these things can fight me. Let's just shoot all the way up into this top purple pipe, again, round two. Um, the green the ones are themed around nature, like, the Emerald Passage is themed around nature, and it's actually the, e it's supposed to be the starting game difficulty, easy passage, and... Gotta bait that arrow. And, whoop, and, uh, the green is themed around nature, it's the easiest. The yellow is themed around, like, children's toys, as you can remember. And, uh, that's actually the second hardest. The Ruby Passage, which I haven't done yet, is supposed to be the hardest one. And, not the hardest one, the second hardest one. And that, it, that comes, uh, third. And that one's themed around, uh, mechanical stuff. And these Bowman dudes, they just want to get in my way. And so we're going to drop down and keep on dropping. Keep on dropping until the party not stopping. And... I think I'm supposed to be fat and hit that rock over there, if I'm a being observant. But, um, red is themed, red is third hardest, they, uh, no, it's second hardest, and it's themed around, like, machinery and stuff. While the, uh, it's third hardest and themed around machinery and stuff, while, uh, blue is themed around, like, horror stuff. I said realistic stuff, horror, it still kind of fits. Come on and slam! Damn. So I called that ride. We can still go down over here, so let's do that. I can just break this block, I think, regularly, and I think I know how to get him up. Man, I must be genius. And the blue is the hardest, seemed around horror, so... Crap, he fell over. Get up. Walk a little bit, and... Boop! Uh, jump cancel! What's going on over here? Uh... Ooh, I... Think there was something up there. I'm... I'm kinda like blanking out here and there, cause like I said, I haven't done this level before, so... Like, usually you can tell I try to pull it off fake it like I didn't, but I usually don't do these blind. Just for the sake of... Giving you a relatively decently timed video. Like, this one's already gone five minutes in, and I haven't gotten absolutely jack shit. <laughs> But, I can tell there's something going on with this thing here, so... 
Let's jump to the moon. And, um... I mean, this seems like something that may be, like, CD getting. So... That's kind of hidden. I'd figure out a way over there. There we go. Gypsy magic. And, oh, shit, I was right. Now time to find the rest of them. Uh... By the way, when I was saying I was totally, like, making it not obvious that I knew the CD in advance, by the way, um... Yeah. Uh... Oh, Jesus. Um... Yeah, I knew the CD in advance. Just the only part I knew in advance. Don't give me pants on dance for... I don't know what the hell I'm even saying right now, so let's get over to these little logs wrapped on... logs. It's a heart, and we keep moving forward, and let's see what's over here. Crocodiles. What the hell? Do they have snorkels and, like, a little floaty thing on their back? Or is that wings or a larval egg sack? Like, what the hell is that red thing on their back? And I don't want to go into good old Wheel Mario. Not Mario, Wario. Lucario. God, I, I can't get any of this right today. And we're just going to send him into his docile mode. And another crystal is at the set two, the bottom half. Now we need the upper half. I had lunch recently, like I usually do. I'm recording this just after uploading the last video. Like, literally, minutes after I'm recording the last video. There's something over there that I missed, and I can't get to it without doing something like this. And, oh. It's a bowman. Uh, that's supposed to be, like, a trick for me to get out of here, or... I hope I don't miss part of the crystal, because that means I'm going to have to, like, do a whole bunch of jank editing. Uh... Wait, can I go down? No, 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 this is not what I wanted to do. Uh, uh, there's gotta be something hidden here. There's no way there isn't. I mean, I, oh yeah, red is, red is like super badass mode who will... No, 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 stop it, stop it, Wario, God, Jesus Christ, I have four minutes. Crap, I don't have the time for this. Ain't nobody got time for this. And so I kind of got to... You can slap your dash instantly by jumping. There we go. There's there's the other half I want to see. And we're just going to... Whoop. What's over here? Obviously, okay, I can't get over there yet. So let's... Whoop. Frog hop. Frog hop. Frog hop. Frog hop. Frog hop. And... I don't know how you get over there. How about that? So let's keep on going right. I'm If I miss the last part of the crystal, I'm going to be mad. Just because... I'm gonna have to do stuff over. There we go! Okay, let's get back and get at the hell out of here and get, finish up this passage world trade center. Oh, what the hell am I even saying? Uh, wait, where? Okay, yes, now I know where I am. I was completely disoriented. I was not having a very oriented mood to play this in. We're just gonna jump through all these lily pads. Why is there so many monkeys here? And I don't mean, that sounds like racial, but it's random. And it so looks like there, you can go under there, so let's just swim Come on, two and a half minutes. So after this, we're going to get to the boss. I got the CD, I got everything else. I have not seen what the boss is, so that one you guys get to enjoy. See, look at that thing. What the hell is on its back? Is that like Aqua Scuba Gear, Gatorade, Feraligator, Swagadile... That's the name of my, uh, sand dial, by the way. I totally didn't copy that from anyone. And Jesus, now I gotta do this to end it. Oh, yeah, something I completely forgot about. Random, not random, but still related to this game. I looked, if you remember right in the beginning, you can pick between hard mode and what's not hard mode, which is this mode. The differences in those games are obscene. And, uh, like in hard mode, a lot of the places where you find, uh, like, a lot of the places where you find crystals that are kind of hidden in normal mode, that's where they put, like, the four-piece jewel crystals, like, that green thing being formed. They'll put those there. The enemies are harder. You start out with less life. And when you beat hard mode... And let the frog switch timers are much shorter. And when you beat hard mode, you get to, uh... Super hard mode. Which is even more of that. They even mo move the frog switch in some places, making it take much, much longer. So, 
it's kind of interesting. Like the uh, beginning level in like the introductory like pink passage level in uh, this game, the one with all the little like things, the things telling you what the stuff is. I can't even talk right now. I'm just gonna do roulette again because that's the easiest. Uh, uh, let's see. Midget eyes, while you know his big old mouth, like in super hard mode, like they'll move it around, like in the beginning stage. It, oh, what? What? Okay, I just suck balls at all of this. I'm just gonna hit this one up then. I I want to get some money. Um, the beginning stage in Mario, I I'm getting so distracted by do, trying to do this, focusing on in the beginning stage. They'll put the frog switch at the very very beginning and give you two and a half minutes to complete the entire level. Instead of giving you like 30 seconds to get from the end of the level to the beginning, which is right next to each other. And so, it's an interesting, like, thing they do, and, um, I try to not read as much spoilers as I can, because I don't remember everything, though I did get to see an image of the final final boss, which permeates my memory anyway, because of how many times I had to do her over. I figured out the timing you have to get for the chests, anyway, to get them just losing the chest during a boss fight oh my god because i you have to get like under a like under a minute left to actually start losing the chest so i could just keep panicking for absolutely no reason and what the what the hell is that thing i am on a fire right now now pick up speed and tell me i'm gay and punch me in the teeth and okay my wheels inside wario wario didn't move game over i got a coin let's see what i can buy with this one coin can I buy something good? Cractus! That's a pun on cactus and crack. This is a cactus that likes crack. I'm gonna drink a little drink that I... I don't even like carbonated drinks, but I'm trying this Nero Bliss that H-E-B is now offering, which is the place of my work. And... Yeah, it's not good. It's not good. Um, yeah, and the prices here are much more expensive in hard mode. Like, this Black Dragon's 20 bucks. I can't buy anything with my one coin, because I'm a scrub. And so... Let's keep on going. Uh, in super hard mode, you the amount of gold crowns you have at the end of the game dictates uh, what the final ending kind of looks like, because you'll ride out in a better car or whatever. In super hard mode, it's the only way you can get 18 gold crowns, because you physically cannot get uh, 18 gold crowns in uh, normal or hard mode, because you can't get a gold crown in the beginning stage, unless you do super hard mode. And I gotta try to hit this guy, he has a crown. I, I gotta bash his head, apparently. He's mad. He's so made. Um, let's see. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. And... It's a train. A little train. And, well, that's kind of neat how they incorporate the crown into like a belt kind of looking thing. Gotta like jump over here and you're gonna be frog hopping, 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 frog you look crazy, you look like rabies cactus. You're, they should call you Rakdus, because you're rabies cactus, and now your eyes look kinda like jelly beans or really weird movies with nipples. I don't even know why the hell I just said that, so let's keep on going. This is kind of a pattern like, um You have very sharp leaves. I'll give you props on those leaves. You probably took a very long time to propagate them. I don't even know if that's the proper word again for propagating. Because proper words for propagating are I don't can't keep that joke going. Um trying to hit you and you're making it really hard. Um, what the hell? Uh, oh, Jesus, you turned me zombie. I... Uh, zombie. I didn't even know that. Uh, oh, it's just time killing so I can not get my treasure. Well, bam! Get a boot to the head. And... Come on, hurry up. Crack this. Cracked out cactus. Obligatory celebrity joke about crack goes here. And... Is he literally doing the same thing again? Let's see if I can... Oh, okay, I can actually score off that. So, I have not much longer time, and now he's going to start mocking me for being zombied. Douchebag. Boss. It's actually kind of neat how they f they put a big focus on these bosses, not necessarily for killing you, because it's pretty hard to die in this game, admittedly. But they put a big focus on just wasting your time so you miss out on stuff. Oh, Jesus, he aims up. I had no idea. So, now we got to bam him on the head. I got four more hits and a minute left. Got to average one every 15 seconds. I can do mathematics, me. And so... God damn it, no! He's making it really hard. And keeping up that average, though. 15 seconds! Come on! 
Come on, it's the Olympics, gold medal. Wario's going for gold crown, gold medal, same thing. I can't do that right, I got two more hits. Two more hits. Two more hits. And bam, two more hits. Now I'm at two more hits. He's going crazy cracked out. And I actually got a score on one of these advances he does. Oh, Jesus. Um, I can't die, I can't die, I'm in... Ball sack, he went slower. I did not see that one coming. Um... We're just gonna have to do a take two here. Um, you didn't see anything prior to this. So let's enter the hallway where he magically has lesser health. What am I talking about? You'll see. Like, for some reason, when I enter the boss a second time, he always ends up with less health. I mean, Jesus. Oh, whoa! How did this happen? It seems like we're at a stalemate three to three. Two to three, Jesus! No, not again. I did not do this wrong. I swear. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus Christ! One to three. He's got the advantage. He's got the advantage. He's going really slow. Trying to juke me out. One to two. One to two. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come back, King. Come back, King. Come back, King. Watch me go. Watch me go. Mm, mm, mm. Nope. Nope. Oh. Damn it. Best of five. Best of five. Best of five. That's how we're doing it. Best of five. Okay, I'm back again, and I'm wondering what the hell is going on, because I can't score at all on the second time through. I, it's 2-6. Two 2-6 six. Two six left. 2-6 six left. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, see, I keep going through them every time. What the hell is going on here? This is so gay. So I got one health, and I gotta hit him five times. I mean, it's the fastest I've gotten him down, but still, this is, like, pretty gay. Because he can't... There we go. There we go. That's what I was looking to score on. Get him into loop. Get him into loop. See, what the hell? What the hell? Best of seven. Best of seven. I swear. Best of seven. Best of seven. Prostrats.zephyrites.com Coming straight to ya. Two five left. Two five. Two five. Two four five. Come on. Shoot me. Shoot me. Shoot me. There we go. There we go. Juke. Take it to Juketown. Juketown.usa And... Nope. Juketown.usa Third time, third time's charm, third time's charm. Come on, bring it, bring it. Nope. Suck a D. And so now he's normal again, so I'll score a hit. And so... I don't know, I got... Uh, I gotta pull some risky maneuvers, I gotta pull risky business here. Risque business. Yeah, like I gotta either get hit or... what? I don't even know what the hell's going on here anymore. Like this is getting pretty gay pretty quick. Two minutes for three more hits, that's one every 20 seconds. I can do mathematics. Now it's gonna go... Run straight under. Come on, come on. Come on! Do, 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 do. That's a Sonic 3 reference. And so now he's gonna warp... Not warp back, he's gonna juke back. And he's gotta war wear off eventually, because I can't take another hit. And there, he's worn off. And so now he's gonna try to take me to... Dick me, give me the choo choo train to Dick Town. I'm just gonna get hit zombified so maybe he goes back to normal quicker. Yeah, he goes back to normal quicker. Holy crap, why didn't I discover this earlier? I could have saved so much time. Oh god, I missed him! No, 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 I'm about to get in the danger zone! Okay, gotta. Bam, one more hit. Zombify me! Unzombify me! Why didn't I not find out this pro strat earlier? Get the hell back up there, Cractus! And come back down. Okay, now it's gonna be super slow mo, so I gotta like take him down like Jason Bourne. Bam! S my D Biz Niche! Mmm! I'm flexing really hard in front of my computer. Cause I'm half naked. No shirt. No pants. Three chests. One butt slam. WrestleMania! One thousandth episode! And so now I got the treasure chest with the crown, lit up the Emerald Passage after like four tries, and that's clear Wario's big old buff. Look at that, look at those pecs. He works out, he clearly does, has quite the upper body exercise. And so now we're going to check out all these CDs about that Shepard, ATS, Hardcore Band. Who let the dogs out? I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one who thought that at this point. Things that never change.
Man, that's a hot dog. Tomorrow's Blood Pressure. What the hell is that album cover? Beyond the Head Rush. That sounds like a legitimate song. And it sounds like we're in Zelda. Some jank Mexican Zelda, but still. Damn. Powerful stuff. Next time we start Ruby Passage, which was technically supposed to be third in order. Because Emerald's... Emerald, I'm pointing on a computer screen, you can't see it, maybe you can hear the noise of me hitting my computer screen. Emerald's supposed to be the easiest, followed by Topaz, followed by Ruby, and Sapphire was supposed to be last, but you know what? I did it whichever order I wanted to. S my D!